Hello guys, so today I'm going to talk to you about COT28. So it's another one of the four star players, and as I was saying, you will need a friendship Valkyria. So basically, what are the issues in this is that you need to use four actives. So you're getting a form of spirit gen, and you need to win before 20 minutes. So you want to win relatively fast. So let's get into it. What is the strategy for this fight? Uh, first of all, I borrow a Valkia. Uh, in this case, it's one from my club. Again, call out to uh, Mepsina for being really cool and lending her to me. So the strategy here is normally I start the ball. If I don't, there's a 50 chance I'm going to lose. Uh, the idea is that Valkia is going to do a pass, so they never get spirit or action start. They keep doing pass, and as soon as I can, Valkia does her slowing down active. Uh, then depending on how much spirit I have, I could even get White Tiger to do an active to Amy, who's going to do an active pen, to Hyung, who's going to do an active pass, to the striker, who's going to do an active shot. Basically, I have an extra active just in case somehow I run out of spirit somewhere. There's still a pretty good chance. Uh, the players you really do need in this fight is only Valkia. All the other players, they just need to be of the same type. A penetrator with a half a bar active, on the left side, some form of passer or anything that can generate spirit on an action, ideally a passer. The reason, again, I'm rolling White Tiger is because of Icy Road that decreases the action speed, who's a nice little buff. Uh, in the front line, you're going to want any four-star passer. It really doesn't make a difference. Uh, I just threw because I like the pass effect and speed she had by base. And she had a rival chain making her even a little bit faster. And for the striker, just anyone, just stone them decently and you shouldn't have any problems. If you want more information on my stoning, I explain them more in detail in the video 2-7, the very first one of the four-star matches. So let's get this started. So hopefully I started the ball. I did. Here, so we just pass it around. We just active as soon as we can, like this, we slow them down. And the more we slow them down, the lower chances there's are going to actually be a problem. So we just want to be sure that we have enough spirit to do everything we want to do. And ideally, not to be taken out by Sammy like I just did, but that's completely fine. So we try penetrate, it fails, but that was purposely valued, so it would always fail. Oh, actually, I didn't think she'd be that fast. Okay, we're fine with this. And here we do an active pass. And then with the active shot, normally we should be able to win this. And voila. That is basically how you do it. I did kind of mess up in the front, in the midline, but that's why in the back line I have Leonard as a long passer. Anyone you can get of a pass or any backline penetrator would have been fine. I just really like using him because in the worst case, he's always a good backup. So I hope this helps you guys understand how to do 8. If you got any questions or comments, leave it in the description. I'll be doing more COT very soon.